Hey, we always live Elvis. Hey, Memphis Mafia kid, and... What's her name? You better remember her name. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, <laughs> Teresa. You know I got a pick at her, y'all. So you, you heard what she said, too. I bet her, and y'all know, <laughs> I just let her say stuff like that. Uh, hey, wait a minute. You just got out of the doghouse. Don't be tripping on back oh, anyway, into it. We're not going to get into all that. About, you know, nobody believes that. They know who the tuner is, and I am the tuna. But anyway, y'all, hey, it's Wednesday. Of course, we're feeling great, uh, as always, and appreciate all the questions and the comments coming in, and that's what we're going to do today. But quick, I, I'd like to give a couple shout-outs. So one is to Veronica Morin, uh, Melinda Burton, and Deborah Diggs. Appreciate y'all watching. Glad y'all are aboard. Stay with us. Tell your friends. And uh, <laughs> I thought you said glad y'all are bored. No, you no. Said glad I you're on no, board. No, no. I got you. <laughs> also, I got a little special shout out. Uh, on the 28th of this month, somebody's going to turn 60 just before I turn 60 in March. And her name is Tondra. Happy and birthday. birthday. Happy birthday, girl. Y'all, uh, with that, hey, before we get started in, in some of the questions, had so many comments on my last shirt, so I got another one. I'm feeling beachy. Yeah. Uh, not, I wish I was at the but beach. I'm ready. I, I, I'm ready for... In May, we'll be there. Yeah. We're, well... I don't know. I don't remember where that shirt came from, but your parrot one everyone commented on that was a Walmart special. Right. <laughs> Thank good for Wally World. <laughs> anyway, hey, let's get in with some questions. Okay, <clears throat> I'm gonna try to pronounce this last r r name. Shirley Romier or Romer. Where did Elvis have most of his meals in Graceland? That's definitely uh, up in his bedroom. Uh, I mean, at times he eat other places, but most of the time. Uh, he had his meals brought up, and and you know he would have them uh, in his bedroom. You know he, he he spent a lot of time in his bedroom, and uh, as as we all know, and that's just the way that one goes. <laughs> Joni Sheridan, excuse me, sorry. Who kept the inside of Graceland so clean? Well, and that you know that ties into another question that asked, uh, uh, and so I'll just kind of since I was thinking of it. They asked, was Graceland uh, clean all the time, or was it messy? No, uh, Graceland was always just pretty much spotless uh, that I can remember. And who did it was those wonderful ladies I was just talking about the other day about cooking. Uh, uh, you know, some of them cooked and did some of the cleaning, and then they had some other ones. Uh, Miss Nancy Rooks, I'm sure y'all are heard, Miss Pauline, of course, Mary, Lottie, uh, you know, they all was was just so, so wonderful. And, and, you know, as you, I think, can tell by the way they're talked about, they, they were just, they were family. Uh, I mean, they were some wonderful ladies and, and uh, they took care of Graceland. They took care of Elvis, and they took care of uh, anybody that, that was up at, up at Graceland. Okay. Xander, who was Elvis's favorite comedian? Well, he had a couple. Uh, you know, Daddy has, has talked about this uh, a few times. Uh, probably his favorite was Jonathan Winters. Uh, of course, he liked Jackie Gleason uh, and, of course, Bob Hope. Uh, and he wasn't a comedian, but I know, and, and I know some of you probably know, but those that didn't, it just come to mind. Uh, he did funny movies, the Pink Panther movies. He loved Peter Sellers, uh, in the Pink Panther, of course. I mean, if you've seen him, who couldn't? I mean, you know, uh, he just, he was, he was hilarious in that. And, and if you hadn't seen the Pink, old Pink Panther movies with Peter Sellers, check them out, watch them. <laughs> Keith Ellie. Where was the washer and dryer located in Graceland? The laundry room was downstairs. Uh, you know, as you go down the stairs, uh, and then you come into the TV room, and of course the bar, and you go into the, the pool room. There, there's a hallway. There's a, it goes out. One of the sides was where Charlie's room was, 
and some of the other guys, you know, over the years that stayed. And in there, there was uh, the room. It was the basically the laundry room, and and you know you could go up and then go back up into to the jungle room. But yeah, all that uh, was was downstairs. And Trace, hold up right there before you ask the next question. I, uh, you know, I know a lot of y'all. Uh, uh, I just want to say that that I mean, you see me with some of these these canes, and I, I just like them, uh, collect them so far. I mean, there's been times when I've had to use them a little bit, but I don't have to. Uh, but I just like them. Teresa knows she's got me several. Uh, the first time I ever seen Elvis with a cane, I, I just thought that was the coolest damn thing I have ever seen. And, of course, you know, with other people, the, you know, the canes were, were, were kind of big in the, in the 70s. But uh, Elvis Presley diked out with his cane was the ultimate. So You know, I, I was kind of against you sitting in a video with your cane or one of your canes. But now I like it, and i tell you why. Oh, oh, oh you better. Because yeah, well. it keeps your hand busy, and so you're not twisting your hands together. Oh. So, hey, that's a good thing. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> hey, you know what? We could have done without that. Anyway. <laughs> okay. Okay, now, I'm just going to say, I'm pronouncing these names as Danny's written them. So if I mispronounce it or a letter was Then it's all out, your fault, like always. No. Okay, this one, Ashley Fabix. That's it. Okay. When Elvis traveled... <laughs> you're spelling it so bad. When Elvis traveled to his other houses, would he take his cooks from Graceland? No. Uh... He did not. And and when we went to, uh, matter of fact, when we went to Palm Springs, uh, Mama did uh, some of the cooking. Al Strata did some of the cooking. And, uh, you know, when they went other places, a lot of times it would do that. Unless, you know, he was going to maybe be there a while. And in the past, you know, he, he would have, uh, you know, cooks and, 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 and house cleaners out there. So... But no, the as far as is 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 taking them to to do that. No, they they stayed at Graceland. I mean, I wasn't there all the time, uh, and I, you know that may be one to run by Daddy. Did did he ever carry any? Uh, I mean, the times that I know of, he didn't. But I mean, it's possible that that he might have. But most of the time, no, uh, he didn't. And Linda Simpson, did Elvis know how to swim? Depends on your definition of swim. Uh, Elvis could somewhat dog paddle a little bit. Uh, enough to probably, you know, get out of a pool. Uh, of course, I mean, it didn't stop him. He'd jump, dive right in, like Mom said, you know, and anyway, and, and you know, and do it. But uh, he was not a, I guess the word, strong swimmer. Uh and probably just to be honest, from from what I've understood, you know, uh, stories and stuff that that mom and daddy said over the years, uh, he probably, I, you know, probably he just really wasn't a good swimmer. I mean, there's no other way, I guess, to put it. But uh, of course, you know, when you're uh, Elvis Presley, and <laughs> uh, I, if I was, I wouldn't care if I could swim or not. So <laughs> until you sank. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> but y'all, hey, we have, uh, like I said, we we have been having a, uh, a great time with all the questions and comments coming. Keep them coming. And uh, y'all, if you, like I said, if you hadn't subscribed, tell your friends, subscribe. We want to really appreciate a, a lot of y'all for that because subscribers uh, has been going up, and that is greatly appreciated. That helps us, uh, you know, keep the videos going. So, my Elvis family, keep doing what you're doing and, and pass the word around. With that, we're going to hit y'all with some, uh, probably a couple shorts here and there this week. We'll be back. Oh, wait a minute. Sorry. I know you just didn't I did. It. I know. Yes, I have you. to. Okay, <laughs> under our last video, I noticed we've been hacked, I guess you could say. If you ever see a comment <laughs> saying it's from Memphis Mafia Kid, underneath the comments of a video as a reply but the font is funny or different than what we usually use or it refers to whatsapp 
That is never us. So I've reported it and got it taken off. But anytime you see that, please don't reply to it because it is it's a spa it's spam. Okay, that's what I had to no, say. No, good. I, I I appreciate that. And, and uh, so they slip by me sometimes. Uh, well, that's and this fine. One got and, by and, me. And, and I will allow the interruption <laughs> this time. Okay. Uh, Y'all, you see what I'm saying? Oh, she's throwing, <laughs> she's throwing stuff at me, but. I'll take care of that just as soon as we finish up this video. But y'all, hey, we love you. We'll have another full-fledged video coming out Sunday. And remember, Teresa, we, we always, always live Elvis. Elvis. Hey, y'all. Thanks for watching this episode of the Memphis Mafia Kid. Please subscribe and hit that like button. Got an Elvis or MMK-related question? Post it under the comments, and we may answer it in a future video. And don't forget to check out Mom and Daddy's channel, EFM Elvis Fans Matter.